This is a great location here in Troy, and we're in the Long Lake Plaza, and it's been such a great location for us. This was our very first pie shop that we opened um, after we had gotten set up in Armada with our pie shop there. So once we moved from our house to the Armada Pie Shop uh, on the 10 acre apple orchard, we've been there, we got up and running, we got a good feel of it. We had picked up a lot of wholesale accounts and a lot of the grocery stores that we were delivering to were out here on the west side of Metro Detroit. And we, so we realized, hey, this might be a really great area to open up a second location. So after a couple of years of really getting the feel of the area, um, looking at many different um, locations, we had worked with a realtor and he had taken us around and he really knew his stuff. Uh, what side of the road do you want to be on? Are you going to be doing um, breakfast? Are you going to have coffee? Do you want the morning commute traffic? Do you want the afternoon traffic? Are you going to be an uh, after dinner destination where people may come in for dessert after going out to a restaurant. A lot of people go to a secondary area. Um, so he had given us a lot of really good uh, things to ponder of uh, how to pick out the right location for another pie shop here in Metro Detroit. Uh, he was great to work with, really knew his stuff. So I recommend finding a realtor that really knows their stuff and understands, uh, you know, the uh, per capita income in a three mile radius, uh, per capita income of a five mile radius, and how many miles are people willing to drive to your location. So he was very helpful. But here in our little Troy location, this would be the wedding consultation room. We do a lot of wedding pies. And so people come in and make an appointment and maybe the bride will come in with her mom or her maid of honor or her fiance and do a nice little t uh, taste testing. So we're excited about this little private room here. It's gonna be really cute. So yeah, we're still open under construction. We still have customers coming in and out. Oh look, so after you have your pie, then you can go over there and do your jazzercise. <laughs> We had a Jenny Craig located right next to one of our locations, so that's kind of funny. But yeah, this parking lot is always jam-packed. Um, there's still always a lot, enough room, though, for a customer parking during our busiest holidays, which is uh, the month of November. Thanksgiving is our busiest time. Um, and then next, uh, Hanukkah and Christmas here in this area are big. And then of course, uh, the other major holidays like Mother's Day, Father's Day, um, and those fall on Sunday and we're open every Sunday. And of course, uh, things like Easter and 4th of July, they're always real big holidays. Here we've got the uh, uniform store right here. So we always have a lot of police officers and uh, those guys coming in and getting their uniforms. So it's a pretty secure neighborhood here. So my daughter has been uh, helping to be in charge of this remodeling here in Troy. And um, so we came out uh, to meet with her and the um, contractor and my husband Dave was out here and my son Zach who's in charge of the coffee area. So we just wanted to check and see how things are going and maybe we'll be open in time for Christmas with the new remodel. We had a great long time neighbor that was over here in um, this other spot here and uh, he finally closed up his shop. He had the Asian market. Uh, his name was Sam and he was a great neighbor to our girls running the pie shop. He popped in every day and checked on us and we'd pop in over there and do some shopping. So the Asian market after over 30 years, he closed his doors last year and um, well, we ended up taking some of his square footage, and so it looks like they've got, you know, some new, some new neighbors here coming in. We've got the nail salon, we've got a coffee shop, a nice restaurant down there, and we also have like the um, Boy Scouts and Girl Scouts here. Secretary of State honey baked ham is big, so they get into honey baked ham's line. They get their ham, and then they come over and stand in our line. So. We really work well together in this little neighborhood, so we're so happy to be here. Uh, like I said, 18 or 19 years. 
so hey if I provided you with some information I know a lot of you have been asking about what your um, where a location should be uh, what percentage of rent should you be paying to sales and I've had a lot of uh, people message me with different questions about locations and so um, I thought I would do a little video here about our contractor <laughs> and our remodel project and just give you a little taste of some of the things that will go on uh, that may go on uh, with you when you are trying to get you know this place uh, painted and wired and the computer system the POS system the tile the lighting the electric all this kind of stuff needs to happen the first time that we moved here into the Troy location my husband did everything and he's very handy with that so we have a lot of carpentry friends and family and plumbers and things that he could just call on and we thought well we've gotten too busy in our life to contract it ourselves so we allowed somebody else to contract it and so that can be a good thing or a bad thing so good luck to you guys as you move forward let me know what your questions are your comments below um, I look at everyone and I'll make sure that I hit up some of your questions and answer them if I can so all right, you guys, good luck with all you do. Give me a thumbs up if you thought I brought you some information today. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button as well. Get a notification every Wednesday we post new videos. All right, thank you.